You went tuned to the wettest channel on the internet. And you're back, and we're back for part two on this beautiful Sunday morning here at Birken Island. And who wouldn't like to wake up every morning to this beautiful paradise place? And I'm blessed and glad I could be here and share with you guys via video on YouTube. And you're gonna see that we're not the only ones enjoying this beautiful place. And I'm also glad that people use my videos to get away from their everyday life of the work and hassle. Because sometimes you need to at least get away mentally and i'm glad you guys use my channel to do this because you already get enough bad news on tv and at least like this you guys could go visit and imagine your happy place and i guess once again the weatherman was wrong because it said that today was going to be cloudy and scattered showers but i don't see that many clouds do you All I see is a lot of boaters enjoying the water with their families and friends. And like you see, it doesn't matter how you get out here. It could be on your jet ski, on your kayak, on your canoe, on your yacht, on your boat, on a center console, and even on a food boat. Like my good friends Aquatic Flavor and finally they're here. So we're going to meet up with them later on at the sandbar. And if you guys don't know who they are, well, they got the best food on the water. And talking about the sandbar, we're going to start picking up anchor and head over there to find a good spot. That even though most of the sand is gone, but there's a little piece there that you gotta get there early to anchor up. And I'm expecting a few of my friends showing up, so I'm leaving now. And I would like to thank my boating friend for helping me out in retrieving the anchor from the island. And that's the way it should be, boaters helping each other, because you never know when you might need it. But now I'm gonna leave them behind and head over to the sandbar. We're here bright and early just like my good friends aquatic flavor and we're gonna anchor near them because you know how they say the early bird gets the worm well i guess we're gonna call it the early boulder gets the better spot And definitely, it's always a pleasure to meet the people that watch the channel. And within an hour or so, our friends started to show up. And today we got my little bro, Cito Rox in La Gaza, hanging out with us here on the boat. And for those people that keep asking me where to purchase the Sandbar Life merchandise, well, every video on YouTube has a link on the description that takes you right to the store and you can get them. And yes, they're made for the water and have 50 SPF sun protection according to the manufacturer and they also make you look good too right?
congrats, the music's up, so the party's gonna get started. But the only problem is, we still have high tide, so we're gonna have to actually swim over to Aquatic Flavor, or maybe look for a ride. But in the meantime, we're gonna wait and see if anybody could do the, the nice charity work. I guess this is a good time to have the dinghy here. And like you notice, most of the people are on the boats because the water here is still kinda chilly for us Miamians. And also I want to say thank you to those fans that see us out in the street and say hi or take a picture and they tag us on Instagram. Thank you so much. And also if you want to send your picture of your happy place in the water or maybe your sandbar in your country or state, go ahead. Just remember to tag Fresco Channel. There is no better place to be than having a good time with good friends out in the water and that is part of Sandbar Life because it's a lifestyle that we all enjoy. And look at this, Ogidas got pretty brave and jumped in the water. Yeah, I got cups. When you go out with Fresco Channel, he has food, fishing rods. No cups, no buns. But no cups? Well, buns, there's a lot of buns around here. <laughs> I hope that didn't go over everybody's head. <laughs> well, guys, finally, we found a ride. Mark came by with his jet ski, so we jumped on it and headed over to Aquatic Flavor without getting wet. For the one bearded pirate. We're gonna get on that boat. We're gonna get on that boat. It's fine. Look, we're gonna get on, the, on, the, All right. on this ship. All right. We're gonna wreck. We're gonna wreck. Gotta get close, close, close. Come on, a little forward. Hey, we not getting top. Thank you, Mark. Woo! What up, what up, what up? Boo, boo, boo! Yo, you already know what it is, who it is, and how it's going down. We're right here. Sandbar life. Too nice. Fresco and the boys. Yo, Nasty Robbins, we're here. You want to fill my cup up? Yeah. Going down in a major way. You see the flow? We got like a Tika here. Y'all ain't ready? Y'all ain't ready? Got that exclusive merch? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. See the name? Oh, yeah. Ready to jump in and help the tight This is waterproof. This is waterproof. Mm-hmm. You gonna see what's going on. Amarillo, amarillo, amarillo. Mira, 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 All right, guys, so definitely dredging out the sandbar made the party a little harder because it's too deep to float around and plus a lot of current. So definitely this experience made me think that the next sandbar party, we're going to host it at the south side of all over. The sandbar right across from the houses. If you have time, go by and check it out. You'll see.
I got you. Hello, hello lady. How are you? There's a lot of courage. Hey, hey let me get your phone. Get your phone. Like you notice, rain or shine, we're still gonna have some fun here at the sandbar even though the sand didn't come out and it's a little bit deep and cold but the fun doesn't stop here. The only thing is gonna stop is this video because it's getting too long so tune in for part 3 because the fun keeps going and we still got Sasha's time and a few shots. And we also did a t-shirt contest that you guys can vote on but all that and more is coming up in part 3.